Hey guys, GMP here for my second edition of Princess Meets Halloween. Now, this one was also selected with Princess Odette, and as you know her, she is the Swan Princess, so I figured I'd keep the flying creatures involved and made her a bat. Now, I did start off just making her in her normal traditional ja uh, outfit with batty features and things like that, as you see. Had loads of fun doing this, making the bottom just the bat wings and her sleeves and everything like that. It was a load of fun. I had trouble figuring out what to do with her belt, but as you'll see later, I did make it into a bat at some point. I don't know how quick into the video I did. And the lace up top, now normally she doesn't have lace, so I just made little cute spiky bits. And I gave her a choker. I know she doesn't have a choker in the movie, but I had to give her a choker. Something to give that little flare of Halloween-y look to her. And I know the sleeves are not exactly the same color as her regular dress, but she's a bat. She's going to like, you know, midnight blue. So absolutely love how she came out. Now, also you'll see uh, later on in the video, I do give her, I do give her some cool bat wings, which were a lot of fun. I, I was trying to find a good texture for her bat wings. So it was kind of hard to find that right, you know, snake-like scale pattern. I'm glad I did. Very happy with it. So, obviously, in this story, I always was confused why they made the Swan Princess a swan. And, you know, in the movie, at least, and Derek was going to kill the swan. You know, a lot of people don't think swans is evil. And for some reason, he thought it was. Which, I get it, you know, guaranteed because of the quote in the movie where he it says... uh it's not what it seems. I get that, but I think he would be more prone to attack it if it was like, you know, the traditional creature of the night. So I figured, you know, I'm going to make her a bat. Uh, the other option I was thinking was, uh, one of the other things was possibly, I think, either clown or spider, which you'll see pop up later. But I wanted to keep her a flying, beautiful creature because I absolutely love bats. That's one of my favorite Halloween-y themed animals. So... Yeah, here she is. Hope you guys like and talk to you later. Bye!